Pluto, the confounding little planet living at the outside extents of our close spy planet bunch, is stirring up enthusiasm inside the cosmic neighborhood local area. Progressing reports show an expected experience with Neptune, raising concerns among scientists and space fans the same. Renowned trained professionals, including Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku, have sounded alerts about the potential consequences of this heavenly clash. However, how did Pluto wind up on an intensive lesson with its distant neighbor, and how should this gigantic effect influence us here on the planet? We ought to examine this unfurling occasion. When remembered to be an unquestionable planet, Pluto was in this manner renamed as a diminutive planet in view of its unusual circle. Regardless of this change, it proceeds to enchant and attract cosmologists. Late assumptions from obvious specialists include a focusing on closeness between Pluto's way and that of Neptune. These experts caution against a reasonable impact between the two planets, addressing a huge risk to Earth. Pluto's excursion around the Sun is set apart by its novel qualities inside our close by planet bunch. Its circle traverses an expansive 248 years, and since its disclosure in 1930, Pluto actually hasn't finished a full upheaval. Adding to its advantage is the profoundly unconventional nature of its circle, a takeoff from the almost roundabout circles of the significant planets. Besides, Pluto's circle is leaned at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane, making its way more limit-contrasted with different planets. One remarkable part of Pluto's circle is its convergence with Neptune's way for approximately 20 years in each circle. Pluto adventures nearer to the Sun than Neptune, opposing assumptions in view of their separate situations in the nearby planet group. So, why hasn't a crash happened among Pluto and Neptune? The clarification lies in the gravitational impacts applied by different planets. The evaluation of Pluto's circle started soon after its disclosure, introducing a bewildering challenge for stargazers. Not at all like the greater part of the planets, whose circles adjust somewhat near the ecliptic plane, Pluto's unmistakable highlights incorporate a precarious tendency and a capricious shape. The secret developed with the acknowledgement that Pluto's circle crosses that of Neptune. The security of Pluto's circle in the midst of these intricacies fills in as proof of the complexities intrinsic in space mechanics. The three-body issue in space includes grasping the movement and gravitational collaborations among three heavenly bodies, like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun. This issue explains the complicated interchange of their ways and gravitational powers. Terms like asymptotic libration, scope libration, and the Kozai wavering add to unwinding this divine enigma. Astrophysicists pronounce that asymptotic libration, answerable for keeping up with planets in their circles, assumes a significant part concerning Pluto and Neptune. This term implies that when Pluto crosses Neptune's circle, it is situated something like 90 degrees away from Neptune, basically forestalling possible effects. Scope libration guarantees that when Pluto approaches Neptune or other Goliath planets, it is situated fundamentally over their orbital plane, giving an additional layer of security against impacts. The Kozai wavering makes sense of why Pluto's circle around the Sun seems flighty, yet stays stable over the long haul. In spite of evident abnormalities, space reenactments in the last part of the 1980s uncovered that, regardless of its steady properties, Pluto's circle is to be sure tumultuous, with minor starting deviations prompting huge changes north of millennia. Nonetheless, Pluto's one-of-a-kind circle keeps up with steadiness throughout phenomenally prolonged stretch of timescales, holding disarray in line. Ongoing programmatic experiences have upgraded how we might interpret how enormous planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn impact Pluto's way around the Sun-Neptune's momentous relationship with Pluto, Finishing three circles for each two of Pluto's adds to the security of Pluto's circle. Besides, Jupiter's huge gravity applies a critical impact, while Saturn's effect, however more modest, likewise assumes a part. Through exhaustive examinations, specialists have shown that the consolidated impacts of Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn guarantee the protected and stable movement of Pluto in space for billions of years. These peculiarities are fundamental for keeping the control and consistency of heavenly developments in the universe. Without these parts, the planetary group would be inclined to more prominent unrest and unsteadiness, 
possibly prompting crashes or discharges from stable circles, causing expansive impacts on other divine bodies. Understanding Pluto's circle is particularly vital in the midst of conversations about a potential impact with Neptune later on. This information gives a more clear comprehension of the unique idea of the planetary group. Pluto's case features the way that apparently unsteady circles can arrive at balance through the perplexing trade of gravitational powers and orbital mechanics. Steady perception and examination of these peculiarities are fundamental for acquiring a superior handle of our situation in the universe. Investigating the profundities of room frequently uncovers the erratic idea of divine bodies, and Pluto's circle fills in as an ideal portrayal of this unconventionality. The idea of orbital tumult strikingly outlines the fragile reliance of a divine body's way on its underlying circumstances, as shown for Pluto's situation. Indeed, even slight varieties in the Peewee planet situation or speed can essentially adjust its drawn-out circle. Automatic reenactments have been instrumental in assisting specialists with understanding how Pluto moves in space. By rolling out little improvements in these recreations, space experts can see what minor changes can fundamentally affect Pluto's direction. In the last part of the 1980s, these reenactments uncovered an entrancing part of Pluto's circle. Regardless of elements like asymptotic and scope vibration adding to its soundness, Pluto's circle can in any case show unpredictable way of behaving. Indeed, even a little beginning distinction in Pluto's situation or speed can prompt tremendous changes in its way over numerous years. Notwithstanding this intrinsic turmoil, Pluto's circle stays stable for a particularly significant time frame, reaching out more than billions of years. This proposes that underneath its apparently unusual appearance, Pluto's excursion around the Sun follows a coordinated example. Expecting infinite occasions, particularly for planets like Pluto that have flighty circles, is very difficult. The characteristic eccentricism of these frameworks makes long-haul conjectures dubious. Numerical reenactments help us understand and predict the future paths of celestial bodies, but they also reveal the limitations of our predictive capabilities. These models heavily rely on precise initial conditions and mimic complex interactions. Even a small error can lead to fundamentally different outcomes, making accurate predictions difficult. The chaotic nature of celestial orbits, such as Pluto's, reminds us of the ever-changing universe. While we've made progress in understanding space, Pluto's case highlights our ongoing limited knowledge. The vastness of interstellar distances and the scarcity of planets in open space act as barriers against frequent collisions. Additionally, rogue planets are relatively rare compared to the number of stars and planets in stable orbits, making such encounters even less likely. Understanding the gravitational impacts of giant planets on Pluto's orbit provides valuable insights into the broader dynamics of the solar system. It demonstrates how each planet's presence and position can affect the stability and trajectory of other bodies in the system. Despite these complex forces, leading astrophysicists express concerns about a possible collision between Pluto and Neptune. This raises questions about why such a collision, which seems improbable given these intricate dynamics, is now a subject of concern. Neil deGrasse Tyson, a notable astrophysicist, offers a unique perspective on the mysteries of our solar system, particularly regarding Pluto. Tyson, known for renaming Pluto as a bantam planet rather than a full-fledged planet, shares insightful thoughts on how our understanding of celestial mechanics is continuously evolving. Tyson views Pluto's renaming not as a downgrade, but as a necessary adaptation to our growing knowledge about the diverse objects orbiting the Sun. His approach to celestial mechanics involves continuous learning and adaptation. He sees the complexities of orbits, like Pluto's, as a sign of how much more there is to discover in space. Tyson believes that the allure of these mysteries makes cosmology so captivating. Furthermore, Tyson is aware of how space-related events and discoveries impact public interest in astronomy. He believes events like Pluto's renaming and its unusual orbit are opportunities to capture the public's imagination and curiosity. By exploring the dynamic and sometimes irrational aspects of space mechanics, Tyson aims to foster a deeper understanding and enthusiasm for the universe. Neil deGrasse Tyson 
opens a window for the general public to marvel at the wonders and mysteries of the cosmos. Working alongside other researchers, Tyson actively warns the public about the potential danger of Pluto's capricious orbit. After extensive investigation of Pluto, he has raised concerns that the three-body problem could pose a real threat, suggesting that a collision with Neptune is long overdue. Moreover, Tyson emphasizes how such a collision could disrupt the balance within the universe and lead to catastrophic results extending to Earth. A collision between Pluto and Neptune would be an extraordinary and catastrophic event in our solar system. This impact would release a tremendous amount of energy, likely fragmenting Pluto due to its smaller size and icy composition. Debris from the collision could scatter across the solar system, posing potential hazards for other planets and their moons. For Neptune, such an impact could potentially for Neptune, such an impact could potentially disrupt its orbit, leading to unpredictable consequences for the planet and its moons. The energy released from a collision of this magnitude could have far-reaching effects, not only altering the trajectories of nearby celestial bodies, but also creating debris that could threaten other planets in the solar system. Astrophysicists are particularly concerned about the long-term implications of such a collision. The gravitational interactions between these planets are complex, and the dynamics of the solar system could change drastically. This could lead to instability, where other planets may be drawn into chaotic orbits, increasing the risk of collisions among multiple bodies. As we continue to study Pluto and its relationship with Neptune, it's essential to refine our models and simulations. Understanding the nuances of their orbits and the gravitational effects at play will help us predict potential scenarios and prepare for possible outcomes. The investigation of these celestial dynamics also highlights the importance of continuous observation and research in the field of astronomy. In conclusion, while the likelihood of a collision between Pluto and Neptune remains a subject of debate, the complexities of their orbits and the forces at work in our solar system warrant careful consideration. Pluto's unique status as a dwarf planet and its erratic orbit serve as reminders of the dynamic nature of space. The pursuit of knowledge in this area not only deepens our understanding of planetary mechanics, but also enriches our appreciation for the wonders of the universe.